in this video tutorial, we were going to convert a negative photo into a real photo screen. So let's get started. I have actually some examples already open in the negative photos. You can check this out. It's all in the negative photo, which is actually some kind of the old era. So let's see how can we convert this into a real photo. So just watch this. Uh, first of all, I'm just going to go to this photo. Uh, that's a photo of a girl. You can find out it's actually in the negative form. So how can we convert this? It's a simple process that you just need to go on this button and just click on it. After clicking, you will find the option which is called invert. So when you will click on the invert, it will turn into the invert form or maybe convert into the real form. It's going to be the RGB color corrections. So go to our next photo, these kind of photos. So same process, I'm just gonna do it with the invert process invert effect so as you can see we have converted both photo into it but the most important things negative photos actually it's an old eras photos the old eras photos normally cannot work like these hd quality we have some difference uh, in these photos because negative photos used to have some old cameras old era so they could not give this kind of a HD quality. So what we can do this after inverting this photo, we have to play with some color corrections options like this. So first of all, I'm just going to make it to the invert. So right now, as you can see, it's actually an old photo. You can find out the quality of this photo. And furthermore, we need to make it with color balancing in a good quality. So I'm going to go to the same side, but this time I will have to select color balance. So we have some RGB color correction and from this point is cyan, magenta and yellow. So we have the green intensity is much higher. If I will take more higher, so you can find out green will be added more. So what we have to do, we have to go to from green to magenta in this form add some blue color corrections now i guess yellow have to prop be proper and add some red colors in it so we have actually watched this the photo was this after converting we create this and after some playing with color corrections or color balance it has to be like this furthermore we need to add something like uh, more saturations in color so you will have to find the hue saturations so throughout the hue you can play with some color changing intensity like this or this but we don't want this kind of thing. i just gonna make it onto zero a little bit i will have to play with some colors because you can find out the colors of a flower is not highlighted so we need to go some minus 12 percent so the colors of flower is prominent furthermore we need to add some saturations to make it sharp colors like this that's a perfect like this so you can find out there's a difference of the color corrections with the hue saturations this time so I have to go to the levels. So levels will have to adjust this from darker tone to highlight. So as you can see this properly process, but if I will do this, like some my white color balance in it, so you can find out that the detail of her shirt or detail of her dresses are going to be disappeared. But if you will make it proper, so you can find out the details proper so now i will play with some black color balancing or some this so i guess it's perfect in the last i just need to go to the curve curve has three options which is 
first is RGB and the next three options is red, green and blue. So it means that you will disturb RGB so red, green, blue, all colors will going to be disturbed but if you select individual so only red color will going to be increase or decrease this time here on the blue only increase or decrease so we need to play with some uh, contrast point good one more time i'm just going to make it color balance one more time so we add some blue because i i guess the lady dress is the dress of this lady is blue normally one more thing that you need to find out because it's the old photo and old photos so it means that you can find out there are some noise in it in these photos there are some noise so i'm just going to go to the basic layer of this image and go to the filter select the noise and then reduce the noise so the reduced noise is have to be proper like this if you will increase the intensity of noise increase the preserved detail and reduce noise detail have to be 100 percent so it will somehow somehow it will be decreased Furthermore, you need to play with some camera raw filter options. It will going into the negative form, but we will play with it like this. So have some amount and uh, clearance. Sorry, clarity have to be a little bit low because it has to be clear. Or somehow highlight it or make it vibrance increase. So now you have find out the green plants here, yellow rays here, and white shirts here, and proper color corrections with it. So guys, I hope you like this tutorial, how to convert this into a negative to positive form like this. We have done this before, from here to this, from here to this, but actually these both photos are normally proper or HD photo, we can call it, but this photo was actually old photo. So we have not only convert it into the invert form but we have played with some color balancing hue saturation label curves and color balance too as well to create this photo into this form step by step we have done this like this one this 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 and in the last we have created this so i hope you guys you have liked this tutorial and if you like this, so please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so I can give you some more tutorials about it. Thank you so much.